Welcome back to News 24. I'm Lucas DeGarmo with sports. Let's jump right in. On Friday night, North Northern State University was in town to take the Warrior men and women on. Both basketball teams were on action this weekend. Mitch Beck uh, hit a shot right away for Northern State to get things started. And then Clayton Vetti answered on the near baseline. This was in the first half. David Johnson is going to hit a shot momentarily. Colin Pryor fades away for the Northern State Wolves to answer. Northern State played very well in this game. DJ there hit a shot from the top of the key to give the Warriors two points. And then answering was, of course, number 22, Alex Thomas, on the other end. Northern State dominated that game and ended up beating Winona State in a big-time upset at McCowan Gymnasium. Then the next night, Saturday night, the University of Mary from Bismarck, North Dakota was town and look at this dunk from John Wahlberg, throws it down hard with two hands, getting the McCowan Maniacs going early on in the first half. And Winona State played very well all game long. There's David Johnson, the lone senior on the team, hitting a baseline J. And you're going to momentarily see Ben Fisher have a nice assist in t inside to Clayton Vetti, dropping it into the cylinder. Austin Melville, as Wahlberg hits this three, caught up with assistant coach Brady Moore. Uh, you know, it was really big because, first of all, we need to stay in the top four in our conference to host a first-round playoff game in our uh, in the SIC tournament. So we need to do that, and then also for regional purposes. Uh, Mary's in front of us right now, so getting a win against a team that's higher above us uh, should help us out um, with the loss last night, especially to Northern. Now uh, hopefully we're still in that top ten. And, uh, and overall for our conference, we needed to get a split at least this weekend. So it was very important. Winona State moves to 16 and 6 overall, 10 and 5 in the NSIC. On Friday night, as I mentioned, Northern State beat Winona State men 69-66. David Johnson had 15 points. Winona State beat Mary then on Saturday night, 71 to 67. John Wahlberg had 19 points, shooting 6 of 9 from the floor. The Warrior women also hosted Northern State and the University of Mary along with the men. And we'll start looking at the Northern State game. Michelle McDonald is going to uh, hit a layup right away here. And Northern State also beat the women, and you're going to see why. They, Jody Reinschman had a heyday at McCowan Gymnasium. There's one of her baskets right there. Anna Wirtz tried answering with a three in the second half, but Reinschman again underneath was too much to handle. Michelle McDonald does her patented up and under move inside the purple lane, and then Jenna Higgins does her best on the other end in transition to lay it in. Claire Steffen is going to get to give it to Anna Wurtz, and Anna Wurtz tries her best impersonation of Michelle McDonald's up and under move again when Ona State fell to Northern State. And here is the Saturday night game as the University of Mary was in town. Anna Wurtz hit a two, two in the second half, and then Claire Steffen uh, went absolutely off. She is a freshman, a younger sister of Jenny Steffen, a great basketball player at Winona State last year. You just saw her hit a second three, and here's another triple. All three of these three-pointers were in the second half, and that would give Winona State a victory over the University of Mary, 79-68 to on Saturday night. And then I mentioned Friday night, Winona State fell to Northern State, 64-53. In that game, Anna Wirtz had 23 points, shooting 10 of 15 from the floor.